Welcome. Today, we're exploring LAN networks, what they are and the different types you can set up. Ready to dive in and learn how your devices connect. Let's get started. A local area network is a collection of computers and associated devices that share a common communications line or wireless links and often share the resources of a single processor or server within a small geographic area. There are different types of LAN. A client-server LAN consists of several client devices connected to a central server, either with cables or through wireless connections. P2P LANs do not have a centralized server and cannot handle huge workloads like a client-server LAN, hence they are often smaller. Cloud-managed LAN is a specific type of wireless LAN, where a centralized cloud platform is used to manage network provisioning, policy enforcement, access control, and other aspects of network performance and security. Token Ring is a type of local area network in which all devices are connected in a ring arrangement. Fiber Distributed Data Interface employs a dual ring architecture, which offers redundancy and ensures the network is extremely reliable. If one ring fails, the system immediately shifts to the secondary ring, ensuring that the network operates without interruption. A wired LAN connects endpoints, servers, and Internet of Things devices to the business network via switches and Ethernet cabling. A wireless LAN connects devices to the network without the need of physical cables. Wireless LANs employ radio frequencies to carry data, making them suitable for connecting computing devices, wearables, smart appliances, etc. Ethernet is a networking technology that contains the protocol, connector, cable, and computer chip required to connect a desktop or laptop to a local area network LAN, for high-speed data transmission via copper or fiber optic cables. It is commonly used in both wired and wireless networks. In a token bus LAN, connected nodes are grouped in a tree-like architecture, with tokens transferred either left or right. The token bus standard connects several devices to large computers or workstations using coaxial copper connections. Let us explore the various architectural components that make up your average LAN environment. Internet. Wired end user devices. Mobile end user devices. Cables and connectors. Centralized servers. Network switches. Wi-Fi router. Modem. Wireless access points. Network racks and enclosures. Firewall appliance network operating system. Network Protocols Network Management Software Network Security Software Application Software Network Services Network Users Network Administrator There are many advantages and disadvantages of LAN. But did you know that LANs are everywhere in our daily lives? From the Wi-Fi network at home to the secure connections in office buildings, LANs are the backbone of our digital communication. They allow us to share files, printers, and even stream video seamlessly within a confined area. LANs are also vital in businesses for supporting critical operations. They help connect computers, servers, and other devices, ensuring smooth collaboration and access to shared resources. Without LANs, modern workplaces would struggle to function efficiently. Whether you're using a wired connection for speed or a wireless one for convenience, a LAN makes it all possible. It brings together various devices, creating a small network that keeps us all connected and productive. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video or learned something new, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tech insights. See you in the next one.